Justin Lawrence versus Emmanuel Sanchez. The motto of that fight is it's not where you start, it's where you finish. Lawrence started out dynamic. He started out confusing Emmanuel Sanchez. He started out landing a lot of punches. He was versatile. Sanchez was plodding forward, looking for his moment to strike. It came at the end of the second round. He found an opening and dropped Lawrence. Almost finished him at the end of round two. That was the turning point in that fight. After that, Sanchez is the one moving forward. Lawrence is moving backward, trying to find his momentum again. And what was so impressive about that is, Sanchez never got discouraged. He never got frustrated. You never saw that, oh man, I gotta turn this around, I'm screwed. He knew, if I keep doing what I'm doing, and I keep the pressure on, and I don't fold, you're gonna fold. What's so impressive about Emmanuel Sanchez is, he doesn't set a pace he can't keep. He doesn't do something in the first round that he can't do in the last minute in the third round. The fight with Justin Lawrence was the stamp on a breakout year for Emmanuel Sanchez. It's the improvements he's made. And he's one of the guys to beat, I think, at 145, who's been waiting for young, hungry talent to come up and show the established fighters that we're gonna get you. I'm on the way.